Good morning. In this week's block news, Generate Press and Storefront are converted into block themes. We take a sneak peek at a potential new user interface for the WordPress admin. WP Zoom release a brand new block theme. Theme variations come to WordPress.org, and Alan Rickman reads the latest Gutenberg review. Let's get newsy. Time for block news. It's news about blocks. WordPress 6.1 will allow us to convert classic themes like Astra and Cadence and Generate Press and Storefront into block themes. And this week, following a fantastic article on Gutenberg Times, which I'll link to in the description below, we converted Generate Press and Storefront to be block themes. What this lets us do essentially is create template parts for a classic theme. In this case, with Storefront, we created three template parts, a header, a footer, and a 404 page. The big, big advantage of this is we now have 100% control over the design of the header. Before, we would have had to rely on the theme options, but now we can design anything we like. I'll be creating a more extensive video next week on how this works and the pros and cons of it. So if you want to see that, hit the subscribe button below and you'll be notified when that one comes out. Oh, and also next week, I'll be letting you know where you can download versions to test out for yourselves of Generate Press, the block theme, and Storefront, the block theme as well. One of the big challenges and weaknesses of full site editing has been the user experience. And there is a lot of work and discussion going on right now about how to improve that. One of the ideas that's being discussed at great length is a browse mode, which you can see up on your screen right now. As this develops, I'll keep you updated with progress and let you know how things are moving along. WP Zoom have recently released a brand new free block theme called UniBlock, and it looks great and it's beautifully built. There's a few really creative things that I like about this. The first is the way they've used core Gutenberg blocks to create nice layouts. You see this example here where we've got this nice overlap of this image on this background. This is actually a really simple thing to do. And next week, I'm going to show you how to do this just with core Gutenberg and no plugins at all. The other thing I really like about this is how they've used styles within blocks. An example of this is the columns block here. They've created this overlap. And you'll see on the left over here, they've just created these different styles that you can apply to your columns. So you can create these nice overlaps really simply. Theme style variation previews are coming to WordPress.org. Theme variations or style variations are like mini themes within the main theme itself. So you can have one theme you could have a thousand style variations within that one theme if you wanted to. So you might ask yourself the question, why do we need all these themes? But that's for another day. Here's an example of what you're going to see with the Wabi theme from Rich Table. You'll see the theme style variations below the theme itself. You can click on that. And if you want to see a real life preview, you can click the normal preview button up here. And that will load a preview of the theme style variation within that site for you. I like to keep a close eye on the latest Gutenberg reviews at WordPress.org. Good or bad, this one is a good one. One of the best things that could happen. It's getting better and better. Although the new editor is polarizing, I think it was the right move and they keep on making it better. In general, user friendliness could be given a little more attention when used on mobile devices. Beautifully summarized as ever by Alan. Thanks, Alan, very much for that one. That's all the block news for this week. If you want to keep up to date with all things WordPress and the block editor, hit that subscribe button down below and you'll be notified every time I release a new video so you won't miss anything at all. Keep well and I'll see you soon.